Hey, what's going on guys? It's your boy Pablo Esco here. Uh, back at it with another video. Um, today I'm going to be going on a hunt. Uh, later on today, I'm probably going to meet up with my boy Ricky. I'm uh, probably going to hit up a couple of stores. Probably going to hit up um, a couple of Targets, GameStops, Walmarts. Uh, probably hit up, um, probably make a visit to one of our local malls here. That um, They have a Hot Topic. Um, they got an FYE and a box lunch over there. Um, so we're going to see what we could possibly find today. Um, I also want to, um, you know, visit one of my, my favorite collectible stores uh, that sells a lot of Funko Pops um, in my area. Um, so I'm going to hit that store up today and, uh, you know, hopefully we can find, um, you know, a lot of good things today, man. Um, as for what I'm looking for right now, um, I am still looking for um, some of the Fast and Furious diecast cars that I recently just started collecting. Um, I'm still missing Brian's um, Skyline GTR. Uh, I'm also missing uh, Dom's ARC-7. Um, Mia's Integra and uh, also Johnny Tran's Honda S2000 uh, so I am definitely on the hunt for those uh, those Fast and Furious diecast cars um, as far as Funko Pops are concerned um, like to be honest with you um, you know I really like just honestly it's, it's kind of hard to explain but it's like when I go on hunts um, it's really you know if I if I see something and you know basically I have to see it in order for me to actually you know know if I really want it or not you know, because sometimes I got there's like so many different collectibles that I'm that I'm looking for. It's kind of hard to remember every single thing. Uh, but you know, once you're out there hunting and, and looking at um, all the different you know shelves and, and collectibles and going to all these stores, you know, you know what you want. You know, you'll see it. You know, you'll know it when you see it, pretty much. Um, so you know, hopefully we find a lot of good things. Um, also, um, I am going to be doing um, you know another Funko Pop whatnot auction. Um, if you don't know by now, um, I am definitely, um, you know, a part of whatnot as far as the auctioneer auctioning um, is concerned. And, um, you know, I, do, I definitely do like going on hunts and looking for inventory, um, you know, especially for, you know, my whatnot family. Um, so if, we, if I could find anything that I think my whatnot family uh, would like, um, I'm definitely, you know, I'll definitely purchase it. And, uh, you know, see and make sure that, you know, I definitely got enough inventory. Uh, but yeah, man, um, let's see what we can find today. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next clip. What's good, y'all? I'm at Target right now with my boy Ricky. Um, hmm. You know, as y'all know, I, I am starting to collect these Fast and Furious diecast cars. They got the Let Letty's Plymouth right here, but I'm not really looking for this particular one. I'm really just trying to get the um, Brian Skyline GTR and Dom's RX-7 and uh, Jesse's Volkswagen next. Yeah, so I'm probably gonna pass pass on this one. This is what they got for Elite and uh, AEW. They got Edge. There isn't a Chase, unfortunately. No, no, ch no chase for the edge. We got China, The Rock, Road Dog, Undertaker. Yeah, not too much. This is what they got for Black Series. This one's always sitting. Got Lando. Here's what they got for Motu. As you can see, it's on sale, $9.99. For Funko Pops. My Valentine, Yu-Gi-Oh, Hello Kitty. Clint Barton from Hawkeye. Uh, same old, same old. It looks like it's the same stuff from the last time you came here, for real, for real. Yeah, nothing, nothing really catching my eye. Got Wonder Woman. <clears throat> they still got these, uh, <laughs> these Motu Poppin' Tees from Target Con. 
let's see. More Wonder Womans. Leonardo, Donatello, Art Series. We're here at Walmart. See, they got some of these WWE prisms. Chronicles. They got these prison UFC cards. Shout out to all my My Hero card uh, collectors. We got some shiny fates. Striking yeah, some waves. Uh, Professor Hall. Yeah, nothing crazy. Got some Darkness of Blaze packs. Exactly what I'm looking for. Brian's GTR. Finally found Brian's GTR. Finally. Let's get it. What they got for AEW and Elite. See, they got more of these things. Luckily, I already have this. Another one. Kenny Omega. Matt Jackson. Cody Rhodes. Sergeant Slaughter. Drew McIntyre. Jeff Hardy, Stone Cold Steve Austin, Bill Goldberg, Here's what they got for Funkos.
Sheesh, let's get it popping. What's going on, guys? Uh, it's your boy Pablo Esco Collects here. Um, I finally came back from another hunt today. Uh, today was pretty cool. Um, I was I managed to pick up a lot of good things that I was actually surprised that I ran into. Uh, so I would say today was a pretty pretty successful hunt. Uh, I'm pretty tired. It's like 9:30 p.m. <clears throat> Eastern time, and um, you know I just want to go ahead and uh, get some sleep. But you know I gotta uh, show you guys what I got. Um, so let's get right to it. Uh, this is the haul portion, um, and uh, today um, I, we we hit up. I, I met up with my boy Ricky. And uh, we hit up a, a couple of stores. We hit up Target. We hit up a couple of GameStops. We hit up, uh, we hit up Walmart. Uh, we also hit up one of our, our malls that had an FYE Hot Topic uh, box lunch. Um, and uh, yeah, man, let's go ahead and um, let's knock this out. Um, so for today, um, let's start off with uh, what I found at Walmart. Uh, today, I actually, um, as you guys know, I am collecting um, the Fast and Furious diecast. And I finally uh, was able to find this Skyline, uh, Brian's Skyline. Uh, this is the, um, the silver and blue uh, Brian's Nissan Skyline GTR. <clears throat> so I was able to find this today. I'm still looking for Dom's uh, Mazda RX-7. And I'm also still looking for uh, Jesse's Jetta as well. Um, and if I could find uh, Mia's Integra, um, I would like to get that too. Oh, and also Johnny Tran's uh, Honda S2000. I definitely need that in the collection. Uh, but yeah, man, I found this today. Um, so that's another one marked off of the list for the collection. Um, let's see, what else? Uh, oh yeah, I was um, I hit up a GameStop, and um, I actually was able to find. Um, as you guys know, I am a, a huge Naruto anime fan, and um, I ran, I came across this Naruto uh, ramen bowl. This is the four piece um, of the for the Kakashi GameStop um, exclusive. Um, I, I managed to find this in the store today. Um, and uh, you know, if you guys don't already know, um, I do uh, I, I do go on a lot of hunts, especially for uh, my whatnot Funko auctions. Um, my next Funko auction on whatnot on the whatnot app is going to be on uh, June fifth. Uh, it's a Sunday at three thirty p.m. Eastern time. Um, so uh, this is going to be up for grabs um, in my next Funko Pop auction. Um, so um, you know, I, I always try to look out for my Funko family. You know, I want to make sure I always got, um, you know, decent amount of inventory and uh, a lot of, you know, things that my Funko family would like. Um, so that's that's definitely going to be in the next auction. Also, another um, Funko Pop that I actually found today. Uh, this one actually, woof, this is a good one right here. Um, shout out to uh, my store, Painted Visions. Um, I was able to find this Breaking Bad uh, Funko Pop. This is the Crystal Ship uh, with Jesse Pinkman. Um, this is actually, I actually got a good deal um, because um, the owner of the store, um, just just so happens that he was actually there today. He's usually not there, uh, but for some reason, uh, I was able to, to run into him at a good time at the store. <clears throat> and, uh, you know, they usually don't negotiate prices, um, but I was lucky enough to talk him down. Um, so I got this, actually, I got this for uh, just that PPG. Uh, and I believe PPG is around like 160. So I got this for uh, 160. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, it's actually, um, you know, this is actually an older pop. Uh, I believe this pop came out, yeah, in 2015, as you can see. And um, the condition is not that bad. You know, uh, these these bigger pops, you know, it is hard to keep in um, like mint condition. Um, it does have a couple of dings, um, you know, on the pop, but it's not too bad. And, um, you know, I am a huge Breaking Bad fan and uh, I am trying to build up my, my Breaking Bad collection. Um, so I was able to run into this today. Uh, but who knows, man, maybe in the future I might I might eventually sell it and maybe I'll put it up on, you know, one of my, um, you know, Funko Pop auctions or whatnot. Uh, but we'll see. But yeah, man, I'm really happy I was able to grab this. <clears throat> um, the value on this is actually going up, man. So, you know, this is a really good find uh, in today's hunt. And uh, let's see what else I got. <clears throat> Let me just make some space for y'all. Excuse me. So yeah, so I found these two. Um, the next, let's go ahead and move on to the next one. Um, today, uh, I managed to find this Sonic Goku uh, Kaioken SH Fig Arts figure. Uh, this one, um, I am also working on my um, SH Fig Arts Dragon Ball collection. Um, you know, so so this is actually would be my. Let's see, I got right now. I currently have Vegeta. Um, I have um, Goku Black, and I have a, a special Goku um, Kaioken Con exclusive um, as well. Um, so this is the, the new Son of Goku, um, you know, added to my my SH Figure Arts collection. Um, I found this today at uh, one of my local uh, Second and Charles stores in VA. 
Um, so yeah, man, I'm happy I got this. I actually got this for uh, for a pretty good deal. Um, it was actually right, um, you know, it's, it's actually under what the, the market price is currently. So I got this for like $29.99. So I thought that was a pretty good deal. Um, and on to the next one. Um, let's see. Oh, I also found, uh, let's see, this is a Chris Paul. This is, um, I am a huge basketball uh, fan. And um, I managed to find this Chris Paul uh, Funko Pop. This is the Phoenix Suns um, jersey. You know, it's unfortunate that they lost in the playoffs, uh, but it's all good. Chris Paul is definitely going to be a future Hall of Famer, and I am a big fan of uh, Chris Paul's uh, game. Um, so I found this at Box Lunch today. Um, I thought that was a pretty good find. Um, and uh, let's see, let's move on to the next one. Let's see what else I get. Um, I also picked up. Oh yeah, let's go ahead and uh, start it off. And um, probably a lot of you might not know this by now, but um, I'm actually a, uh, a, a huge Mandalorian uh, fan. Um, I'm not like a real like big fan of um, a lot of the Star Wars, like Star Wars really, um, but I do follow Star Wars and um, I really, like for some reason, um, I really enjoy the Mandalorian show. And ever since, since I watched the show on Disney Plus, um, I started collecting everything that's Mandalorian related. Um, and um, uh, probably after this haul video, I'll probably give you a little tour um, of my Mandalorian um, little section that I have. Um, I have a nice Mandalorian uh, dedicated shelf um, out in my living room. Um, and I'll probably show that to you, if, if not in this video, definitely in a future video. Uh, but I got this uh, Black Series. <clears throat> this is the Black Series uh, Beskar armor uh, figure. I got this from Tonshe Station today. And I also picked up, uh, this is the Mandalorian Black Series. Um, this is the OG one uh, with the red, the red box, as you can see. Had to pick these up for, um, you know, for my shelf, my Mandalorian shelves. So I, I managed to pick those up. Let me make some space, guys. I apologize. Oh, man. Oh, got too much room. Got too many collectibles in this room, you know? <laughs> but yeah, let's see. Yeah, so I picked up these Mandalorian uh, Black Series figures, and oh, and one more. Come on, man, you already know I had to pick up this uh, Grogu, <laughs> the Child Black Series um, figure. It's so small, man. <laughs> but yeah, man, I picked these up today, you know, <clears throat> had to pick these up, man. So I, I was able to get all three of these today. Um, so, uh, you know, I'm only trying to like really collect um, like the Mandalorian, the main character. You know, so, you know, there's a lot of different characters in Star Wars and the Mandalorian show. Um, so, but I'm just trying to stick to like certain characters, if you know what I mean. And uh, let's go on to the next one. Um, I found this uh, Cactus Jack. Uh, this is Cactus Jack. This is a GameStop exclusive. Um, I managed to find this today. Um, you know, I am trying to, you know, build up, uh, build up my WWE Funko collection. Um, so I picked this Cactus Jack up. And I also found this uh, at Target. This is the Oswald Cobblepot. This is the uh, from the the new Batman movie. Uh, movie. Uh, this is the Chase. I ran into this Chase, and um, you know it's a Chase, man. I can't leave. Like my motto is N leave no Chase behind. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I had to pick that up, man. Um, and who knows? I might put these in my uh, my future uh, whatnot Funko auctions as well. Um, but yeah, man. I think that will probably conclude uh, the haul portion of my of my video. It was a pretty uh, solid day uh, for hunting. And I'm uh, pretty tired now, man. But, uh, you know, as, as always, I, I truly appreciate everybody's love and support. Um, if you like what you see, please feel free to, to, uh, to like and subscribe to my videos. And um, until next time, man, I'll see you guys soon. Be easy.